Hey guys, it's me, Angie Paradox. I'm here, of course, with Butter of Butterdum here in the game. And of course, behind me in real life, I have my uh, two dogs as well. Hey, Butter. Hey, Bubble. Aww. They're, hopefully, they'll be quiet today. They seem to be pretty good today. They're both just sleeping. The puppies on another room because the puppies are just always <laughs> trying to fight. <laughs> uh, we're expecting a plague of pirates on our coasts. There's a rumor that you're supporting them. Can you please put my mind at ease regarding this, for I assume that this is not true, or is it? Well, I am a humble man. I think I'd reassure him. I must reassure him. Yes, we will reassure the, the Exne kingdom. We are not helping any such thing. You are a driveling spider and a liar, and I'll have you know that our pact has been broken through no fault of mine, but through your treacherous actions, and your mother was a hedgehog. May your days be filled with deserted, deserved misery. The filthy lecher. He's broken our alliance. No! But I loved you. We got married. That's it. I declare war. I declare war for your sister. Was it your sister? No, your aunt, I guess. Yeah. I guess it was the aunt, wasn't it? Did we marry the aunt? Who the hell did we marry again? <laughs> I don't even remember now. Ah, oh, that wasn't you. I clicked on the wrong one. Yes, yeah, Selma. Maybe we'll have to push her claim if we can get that into a position where maybe he dies. There's a few years. I don't, I'm not sure if we'd be willing to kill someone. There's a good chance that we could kill him. Would Butter be willing to kill him over this? I mean, we are humble. I mean, I'm not sure if we'd be saying we would or not, to be honest. Being humble, I don't think would stop you from murdering someone. Huh. Tend to dislike pride. Yeah, it's just about pride. Then again, if I kill him, it's because I'm angry about it. Because of what he said, and that sounds like pride. We'll let it go for now, maybe. Hmm. Not sure. What should we do with this person? Then we imprison them? What are they trying to do here? Fabricate claim on the Duchy of Normandy. Okay, we'll leave them for now. Hopefully they will end the plot. They do have it on to automatically stop plots, yes? Okay, yeah. Just making sure. Wasn't sure if it was actually doing that. The Bear Empire, though, again, like I said before, has been very stable, very peaceful. I don't like it. I don't like this at all. I guess because they're busy in the war against Johnson. I'm starting to think Blossom might fancy me. Blossom Porsa, make a move. Uh, I don't know if he, he's brave, diligent, humble. There's no reason saying yes or no again. Okay, let's make a move then. I went to her chamber and gave her a good tumble. There we go. Uh, he died frothing. He is dead. Oh. Someone else. No no one else killed him. He just died of uh, rabies. <laughs> As you do. And so that means King Vitatus is in charge. Now, he is willing to uh, make a pact. Or I could claim it for my son's wife. I think this is too much of a good opportunity to really let off, isn't it? It's it's too good an opportunity. He's only got a thousand men. He's 12 years old. He's not even of the bloodline. She's of the bloodline. She deserves Exne. And that would then sort out this area. So there we go. We're going to claim it. For her. Have they kids yet? Is she pregnant? She's not pregnant. So it's not really mine yet. We got four years. Then again, that time they could have a kid anyway if I took... Yeah, let's just do it then. Let's do it then. We'll have an alliance at least anyway. We're going to claim this. I claim Exne for my bro my son's wife. Of course. This is not something for our families. It's because she deserves it. She's obviously the rightful heir to the Exne throne. She is of the bloodline of Ironside. And you guys just missed a, a few seconds of footage. because And, and actually, I did as well. Because apparently... Uh, my recording software just went off, and the game was continuing on. So that was great, but yes. Okay, let's see what just happened. Okay, we got our men almost back there. Okay, all our men are almost together. They've got their men formed and are down here in Nance, but we should be fine. If I actually bring these guys together, that should be enough really to take them down. Goofy is 21 Marshall now. Uh, Rock Dove will go, and Sapphire Roan. So yeah, the same commanders that we normally use. They've been good to us. We've got a few more men just there. I might just delete them, because they, they were just a bit late to the party. A bit late to the party. Nothing we can do about that. They're going to have to go. These guys have already gone. 
It's a big army that they have, though. Now, if we do attack them there, there would be a river crossing penalty, but we do have more men. I'm going to head straight to the capital, though, instead. Yeah, let's head straight to the capital. They're taking Nance, but that's fine. I think we'll be fine. We'll come take this, then. The capital will fall. We take this in name of my son's wife. My lover, Blossom, has just informed me she's pregnant with my child. Ugh, the humanity. The humanity of it all. Um, 19%. We can march up here and take that, which we will do. We probably should go attack that army, but I'm okay with this. As long as we've taken that, they'll probably want to come back to try and get that back to get some of the war score back. That's generally how the AI, I think, would think. Well, they're coming back, then we can see that. Now, this is plains. And is there any river crossing? There's no river crossing. So we're, we're better off fighting them over here, so that's good. They're going to come over here. We'll take this for now. If we take this and we beat them in the battle and we go take these back after, we might be able to win just from that. Come on, we lost a few men, though. We did lose a few men, but let's go attack. This is time. Goofy, I've got great commanders. Our dog commanders are pretty good, I have to admit. Go on, Goofy. And they have no commanders. The young boy has no advisors, no supporters really to help him lead his armies. And so they got absolutely crushed. And so if we go down here and take Anju and Nance back, 90%, it's def- Yeah, that's definitely ours then. 96%. A son was born to Blossom. Ah, oh, little Blossom, my, my loveliest. And much docs just became what was that he was a mastermind theologian wow it's a very very learned boy that one good job my son 96 okay we'll just take this then oh only only gave us two percent apparently so that was only giving them two percent so we'll go take this there that should be enough and there we go done enforce it and so he lost his position, and so my son has gone to be king of Axne with his usurper wife, Queen Selma the Usurper. She's a duck, of course, but they have a baby, which we hope they do soon, Mr. Shaggy Dog. Those babies, those sons, those docks, children will all lead Axne. So that'll be nice. That'll be quite nice, I think, for us, you know, having like this border kingdom be another dock's kingdom but it can't go anywhere it's like stuck inside us in a way but we'll see obviously this means that aquitaine will stay just down here then hopefully then again if that boy is meant to inherit so he's got this still and his son has that so he dies yeah this boy that's gonna go to them that's going to be annoying. That's going to be very annoying. If, she, if he dies, though, it goes to a, the girl duck sister. And for him, we may need to kill that boy. Hmm, he's not going to die. If he were to die, though, it might fix the problem, potentially. Uh, Labradorinia, though, is in its own problems there. Gelrean Labradorian subjugation with the Duke of Gelray. <gasps> Of course, the bears. The bears have come for Labradorinia. They want to subjugate them. Duke Bearclaw. It is a dog. How, how dare you pretend to be a dog? How dare you act like you're a dog? We know where you came from. Your ancestors were bears. How dare you try and take on our culture and our ideas and our castles. First you take our homes, then you take our women, and now you take our culture. You disgust me, bears. Okay, Doggy, you're going to be my chance, Doggy. Uh, some of these names are stupid. <laughs> um, but yes, leave it as it is. Um, we can build some more. That's the castle. Um, Bell, okay, one more then, and this one will be done as well. So that will be done. This is done. That's done. This one's done. That one's done. Okay, next then would be this one, I think. We'll go for that. Pirates have been marauding in increasing numbers all along the coast of Butterdam recently. Worse, there's a rumor among the common folk that the pirates are being aided by Exnian agents. Wait, 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 wait. They had pirates and they thought it was us, and now there are rumors that we have pirates and it's them. Huh. It doesn't make any sense as well, because we put her in charge of her throne. I'm sure she wouldn't do that. 
Then again, there she is a duck. Then again, she's a duck, and ducks are known to be a bit quackers. They're a bit, you know, here and there. They they change their mind very quickly. I do love though the little swords and shield they give the ducks there. <laughs> they give it to all of them. Look, ah, uh, it's nice. I must say I do not approve of the tone of your last letter, accusing others to try and obscure your own failings. I should try to repair this. Yes, we'll try and repair it. We're humble. We're humble. We're gonna keep things happy. Do they have the strength? Oh no, what's this? Du jour war over blows. Now everyone's attacking them. Oh no, 15% for the Duke. No. Border disputes, du jour. I can't take it for my own. Very well, if it must be so. Okay. Your words of apology do not ring true. I'm no fool. What? What? This is silly. I just apologized. You... I was the one that was attacked. I couldn't even choose to send the letter or not. Ah, this stupid game sometimes. But okay, we'll let time go by then. It's fine, you know. Her children, hopefully she has kids, will be our children. So, you know, our family at least. So, there'll be dogs leading X and E. So, that's fine by us. And docs is, of course, that's the most important part about it. But we'll see how things go. But we can't have this guy die. He's 51. There's a good chance he is going to die. There's quite a good chance. Improve relations. Okay, let's go back in then. The Lollard Faith is triumphant. The Bear Empire's still being led, but he's 32 years old. No kids, and his wife has got gonorrhea. So, yeah. Okay. Uh, Shaggy Dog. Shaggy Dog. No! And she's not pregnant. Shaggy Dog, no! I know you want the best son, but come on. Damn, we gotta get this marriage back. Sapphire. Okay, she would marry Sapphire. What about Much? Much, my other son. The, the, the learned boy. The learned boy that he is. She will do it. She loves us, that's why. I accept your suggestion. It's normal, yeah? I didn't accidentally click matrilineal, did I? <laughs> that's the sort of thing I would do. Okay, so we got it back. Much is now going to marry her instead. The younger boy. They're about the same age still, so it's not a big deal. Okay, that's fine then. But Labradorinia could go into the Bear Empire. This is not what we want. How's it going? 7%. He could still fight back. How many men does he have? 1,900. It's not that crazy. Um, excellent. Good job, everyone. Oh, the, the air, though, is in jail. Yep, they ca- okay, they captured the air, 74%. No, Prince Spotty. We're gonna have to kill him. <laughs> We're gonna have to kill him. It's the only way. We're gonna have to kill- no, if I kill him, they'll get it. Yep, nothing we can do about this. We could just have Labradorinia. Damn it! The, the tides of war against the Bear Empire is gonna get worse. I thought we were making progress. I thought we were building towards something. But it looks as though actually things are going to get worse off before they get better. Just going to have to, just have to make do of it for now. Just going to have to let things go as they are. And we'll have to fight on our own. Maybe just butter them. We'll have to stand against them on our own. So, okay. Oh, yeah, because it's a judge. Yeah, it goes underneath it as well. Okay, so it still goes underneath it. So that could be even better than if they have a kid. Yes. There we go. Okay, so that could all end up being Doc's land. So that's great. Okay, I'm happy with this. That actually works out quite well. I don't know what I was thinking. Why was I thinking it was going to be independent? I guess if... Nope, I don't know why I was thinking that. Yeah, if he died, it would have gone to him. It's a duchy. For some reason, I thought it was a kingdom tier title, obviously. I don't know why that was in my head. Uh, we have enough money to build up to the next one for this. He's one away as well. See, look at that. We're slowly building a feudal butterdom. But there is a dangerous pact. Independent. Now, this is what we're worried about. The tribals are getting a little bit upset. They're getting a little bit upset. Could we have an alliance one day, please? Uh, King Bearcore of Labradorinia has usurped the title Kingdom of Labradorinia. The bears are still after us. Even after all this escape into the west. Us and the Labrador family, we escaped west. We've been rebuilding the west. Well, not rebuilding, but building up the West after the humans and the ducks were here. And now, they've just eaten them up. Oh, this is this is horrible. What is this? 
He's the only one left. Oh, okay, it's part of that, that's why. Ah, oh, there is a dog. Oh, no, he's a duck. Okay. He's, are you a duck? He's a dog! There we go, High Chief Blake of Daphine. There is another independent dog. Oh, I'm so happy. And of course, there is one over, there's one over here in Bohemia, I guess. So, you got one on the outskirts over there and of Cilicia. So there are a few dog independent people, but no kings left anymore. Those fiends, that bear empire will never leave us alone. Leave us alone, you damn bears. Stupid bears. Okay, well, my plan has kind of gone down the toilet. Damn you. Damn you, bear claw. Damn you, bears. We will not let them. We will remember the Labrador family. Are they still alive? They are still alive. They're now vassals. We'll remember the Labrador family. We'll remember them trying to build up their own kingdom beside us to fight off the bears. We'll remember. We'll free you as well. One day we'll all be free. We'll all be free. But now we need allies. Bohemia, how many men do you have? 1,400. Um, you're a duck, yes. You, though, have a... Okay, none of them have many men. None of them have many men at all. The others are ducks. Damn. Damn them. This guy, she has 1,700. He's a duck. Yeah, he's a duck. Gotta remember, this is not what his culture is. I mean, what makes a man? I mean, is it blood or is it culture? What makes a man? Then again, he obviously has duck and dog blood, so what does that mean? I, it's so con This world of animals is so confusing. My vassal high chief Jadatus of Poitou has requested that I lower rank vassal should serve him rather than me directly. Impress him with vague promises. Who's he want? With that one. He's got quite a bit of land, so I'm going to yeah, impress him with vague promises. That would be a bit too much. A bit too much. Now, where is the baby? Make a baby, King Much. Come on, Much Docs. You are Docs after all. Have a baby. Because our other son will be King. Sapphire will be King. We want you then to make sure she gets pregnant. Because then after that, it's Bubble. Little Bubble. Princess Bubble. Maybe Bubble could become Queen, potentially. Um, 96%. Okay, that's going worryingly high. You. Chief Face, you actually like me. You're not, you don't even not like me much. Uh, Master of the Royal Elephant, there you go. <laughs> Could you imagine the duck being in charge of the elephant? It just, it, just the difference in size just make it ridiculously difficult for them. But okay, just flapping about. Tal can be usurped. The High Chiefdom of Anjou. Well, do we usurp this? 157 gold, that's a lot of gold to usurp it. What do we really gain from that? I don't know. I'm not really sure what we'd gain from that, but you know what? Let's take it. There we go. I take it off them. <laughs> Just because I want it and I can give it to my kids. Oh, I've got two sons now, actually, don't I? To pass on my stuff. And we may have too many Dutch. Yeah, we probably have too many Dutchies. Paris, Picardy, Anjou. I need Normandy. We'll probably give away Anjou. The de jure is this. That's on Jew. Hmm. I could give it to this guy, but then he have that guy underneath him as well. Might not be what I'd like. Um, the other one I could give away is Picardy. I have that piece up there. And that's very close to the Normandy. So I might want that one in Normandy. So we should probably give away Paris and on Jew. Okay, let's have a look at Paris then these ones. Now this guy already has something, so I could give it to Papa. He does actually control the place of Paris. So we could give it to little Papa. Plus he's young, so he'll love us for a long time. The Papa family. I don't know. Let's have a quick look again. Yeah, it would include just, just these kind of ones here. He won't like that. Blows, but that, that includes that. Yeah, De Jure would not actually include Orleans. I probably shouldn't... Okay. I think we give it to Paris then. Okay, Countess Pluck. Papa. <laughs> Pluck. Papa. Or the good boy family. I'm just trying to think about their histories. And their histories are both kind of similar, to be honest. Okay, let's give it to the one in Paris then. Congratulations, Mr. Papa. Uh, Mrs. Papa. The Duchy of Paris is yours. The council would not like this, though. 
Okay. What about then? Oh, Goofy. Oh, yeah, it's Goofy, isn't it? Oh, we should give it the Goofy. Of course. Okay, if I'm going to... It's going to give it the Goofy. He's a great fighter. But these guys are not happy about that. So we we'll have to just leave it for a little bit. I want to give it to Goofy, though, if we can. We'll give that one to Goofy. This one over here, I think we should probably give it to you. Because you are the strongest one over here. They don't want me to give it out, though. The council's been very picky. The council's been very picky. Or we could give it to this guy and saying... No one in the council wants me to give stuff away. Fine, council. See, you don't like me because I have too many duchies. But then you won't let me give away the duchies. It's... It's, it's bonkers. It's bananas. No. Oh, he adopted a few... Okay, I thought we were to say Goofy died. I was like, no! Goofy! I mean, we could change our council. I mean, it's probably time. Goofy should be the marshal. Definitely. Definitely Goofy should be the marshal. I think then they'll let us do it. Goofy's obviously going to support himself. Um, face would be the best, and he does like me. So let's put Face, is it? And then we got this one. Probably should make this one it. That one is better. Let's do that one as well. We do have a bit of conversion to do, so we'll go and convert this. There we go. Look at that. Look at that dog. <laughs> it's, it's a bit of a... It doesn't look like a dog, does it? It looks a bit like a human being, that one. Hmm... Hmm, that looks like a human being to me. God, they're so lazy. So late They couldn't even animate new dogs and ducks and dragons and other... Could you imagine the elephant one? Oh, God, if they had to animate that. But, yeah. Okay, let's give Paris to you, Mr. Goofy. Hopefully... There we go. They agree. They like it. They love it. They love it. Duke Goofy Good Boy of Paris. And we'll give you that one. He's big enough. Oh, they don't want me to give it to them, though. They don't like it, because it's not for one of them. <laughs> They're like, no, I want it. Okay, maybe I should... Okay, we'll just leave it for now. Then. I'll leave it for now. We had free before. Okay, we'll keep free now. But that, we need to wait for the next rebellion. The next rebellion, we may need to make a move against the Bear Empire. The longer we wait, the stronger they are right now. Because, obviously, they're united underneath that damn hedgehog-looking bear. Ugh. Nothing we can do about it for now, though. We'll have to just wait and hope they don't go after us next. Just like the Labrador family. Ugh. It's not escaping several of your commanders lack formal training. Hmm. Okay. Fine. We'll owe you a favor. I can do that. Uh, the hedgehogs still seem to be the same as usual. Uh, the conversion of Gascoigne. Ooh. The tribes of Gascoigne have been converted to the Jane faith. Okay, so that was these guys down here. They've now actually converted to the Jane faith. Please report that your errant subject, Dylan's converted to the Hindu faith. Okay, how's the religions looking then? Yeah, so Jane down here, these sort of... They were African faith. That was the African faith before. Now there's no African faith. We've kind of got the Hindu still around here. But Jane is the big one. Look at that Jane. Look at that Jane. Got, a bit, got quite a bit of Jewish, but the Samaritan faith. Look at that Samaritan faith. The bears... The bears not of the bear empire are really pushing the Samaritan faith, to be honest. They are really going for it. Okay, dangerous faction. We need to stop this. I need to send you some money. Yeah, please stop it. Please duck. Please face. Please leave. If you leave, I think we'll be okay. Come on, leave. I sent you money. You've got 89. <laughs> You've got 89. I'm going to make you designated regent because then it's 99. You'd leave that stupid faction. Um, he should definitely leave at 99. You must love me. What's stopping you? Who are you working for? Who's, who's giving you... What are they giving you? Who's giving you what? Are they giving you money? Women? Men? Bears? They're giving you bears? They're giving the ducks bears, aren't they? He is a bear fetish, of course. I knew it. I knew those ducks couldn't be trusted. Was burnt at the stake. Okay, one of the Bear Empire family was just burnt at the stake. She was married to a duck. Well, she probably deserved it then. Uh, wait. They were married to Grape. Uh, another Grape. Okay. Um, but yes, uh, my lover Blossom just informed me that she's pregnant. That reminds me of my son. <gasps> yes! It's done! Bustle Docks will inherit Exne Kingdom. Ah. Uh. It's a beautiful sight. It's a beautiful sight. 
Um, we can't get Alliance back now. Okay, I'll have to wait for that. But yeah, guys, we're going to end this part here, guys. Sorry about that one blip with the recording software. Don't know what happened there. But we'll be back soon. But things are... They didn't go our way completely, but they are going our way now. You know, we've got Aixney. It will become a Dock's Kingdom. Don't know how we're going to use that. We do obviously want to try and create an empire. Maybe if we make an empire, maybe we might be able to vassalize our own family, potentially. I'm not sure if they'd be willing to accept, but we'll see. Maybe I should be going after Bourbon next. Uh, we are still obviously building up our land. Because right now, I still only got like 3,000 men. It's it's not much. Because still, most of them are still tribal. We're going to need to... Ooh, we actually built a castle. Ooh. That's not bad. That guy actually built castles up. Good for you. Can I now actually give you that title? He would be able to get on Anjou now. There we go. Duchy of Anjou. Congratulations, Duke Care Von Kurz. You know what? He, he may be a human. We haven't had much interaction with the humans, but, you know, he did a good job of taking over these lands, you know. His family, the Von Kurz family, obviously very strong. We want to keep them by our side. So giving them that could be good. Didn't make much difference to my men, but okay. Fine. But yeah, guys, see you next time.